Alright everybody, Expedition 8, Hushed Highlands. Um, bonus type of ground, 8-1 um, is a requirement of 6,500. My team total right now is 9,318. We recently just completed Expedition 7. So without further ado, let's move on to Expedition 8. What's up, Unusual? How's it going, bro? Just defeated a hard boss in Expedition 7, so it was like super cray. I one-shotted it too, which I was like super shocked about. I gotta, re I gotta remove Rock Boss now. It's like not needed anymore. <laughs> it's actually not that bad, which is... Yeah, it's actually gonna be great here. Against Rock-type Pokemon. But I mean, no, it's, it's not even... Yeah, it's actually pretty damn good. I'm surprised. Cloyster, Rock Blast, and Withdraw, Water and Ground type, and then Flareon using Fire Blast and Flamethrower with Alakazam, Psycho Cut, and Dazzling Gleam. Right now, so far, this is going great. I'm still shocked that we were able to accomplish another expedition today. Level 7 completed. Now, I believe Expedition 8... I'm stuck on the same expedition as you are. Ah! Well then. What's your, uh... What's your main team consist of? Like, what do you normally use? As for Expedition 8, I believe it's Nidal King and Nidal Queen as the final bosses. Um... That was probably the most difficult I had with all with out of expeditions uh, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Expedition eight gave me the most difficult problems and challenges to face off against. So I'm not 100% sure if we will be able to accomplish that today. But I do have a lot of battery recharges today because I was able to accomplish uh, expedition seven. So yeah, we'll give it a, we'll give it a chance. Well, we got through this one pretty easily. But again, this is only the first level of Expedition 8, so... Gotta do what we gotta do. 23 cooking regions. Wow, we stacking. Hopefully that gem is decent. Three eleven, not bad. I'll check it out later. Alright, Hush Highlands. 8-2, 7200. Get straight into this with a new move set for Cloyster. I'm actually gonna not play this on auto because I wanna actually try to do this. So give me a second here. So if I use withdraw, can I stack barrier? No. Fuck. So which one's better? Well, I might as well put you on auto then while I figure out which one's better. <laughs> Alright, so you can't stack your defensive capabilities. Withdraw or barrier. Pokemon quest. Yeah, this is going to be difficult. Give me a second here. Got chat open. Oh, it doesn't matter. They both both withdraw and barrier do the same thing. Yeah, they do the same thing. So with that being said, I need to change it. Oh, there's e okay, so even Harden does the same thing.
All right, well, that's good to know. Yes, it is. I believe I've told you before. All right, so we're able to complete this. So I need another Pokemon so I can replace Barrier. I'm going to keep Withdraw because it's just a Water-type move, and I just feel Withdraw is cooler for Cloyster because Cloyster actually has a reason to Withdraw. Some Pokemon can learn Withdraw, and they really don't have the capabilities to really Withdraw. <laughs> Cloyster actually lives in a shell, so I'm going to keep Withdraw over Barrier. Oh, wow. 33 and... Oh, dude, we got some epic stuff here. Level ups, please? No? Nope. Alright, but we're close. 266, 292, Whack Whack Stones. Number of move repetitions. That's not bad at all. Let's keep this going, boys. Expedition 8 level 3, team total of 7,900, but mine is at 93.21 at the moment. Should be able to accomplish this on auto. For those of you tuning in, yes, I understand my cloister has withdraw and barrier. And I know there's, there's, there's no benefit of having both, so bear with me. I will be removing one pretty soon. Once I get another Pokemon, and hopefully it's a water type that allows me to do that. Or a psychic type. Or a shelter. So I get the 100% chance of uh, switching out barrier to something else. Kinda want Ice Beam, if I'm to be honest with you, or Supersonic. Supersonic would actually be really, really lit in this game. I hate Supersonic when I'm playing actual Pokemon, but in this game, having CC capabilities is next level. Because it actually works. What? Are you talking about my stream name? The 11th Hour Gaming Show? Why is that? You can't just change names out of nowhere. You gotta stick to what you, what you are. Otherwise, people won't know. Alright, so, we're now facing up against the boss. I really don't remember this level at all. There's a... Doug Trio? That's definitely not the boss, though. Oh, okay. Sans... No, it's not this, either. That was a devastating fire blast, though. Close quarters, and you get some nasty damage off. <clears throat> this is an interesting level. Okay, Kangishkan. There we go. Makes sense. So yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the level or the expedition where, uh, hold up. Barrier is universal because of the stone. Oh my gosh, I'm getting rid of the rift draw. I can make barrier universal because of the stone that I've equipped to a cloister. Oh, this is really good. Oh, my team's got some... Oh, we got this. Well then, what do you suggest? Because I asked for suggestions before, back when I created it, and no one gave me any suggestions, so... I decided to come up with my own. 287, 277, not bad. Might be able to use that. Alright, Expedition 8, level 4, 8400. Getting closer to where I'm currently located at 9321. Still gonna keep this on auto, though. Ah, so that makes sense. I never read the damn tutorials or the, the key tips. Alright, so I need to get rid of Withdraw because whenever Cloyster uses Barrier because of the, the gems that I have on it, it's universal to my whole team. Which makes me have to play this. <laughs> I'm going to switch. I'm going to play this. Watch. Barrier. The whole team gets it. Alright, back to auto you go. I'm confused on what level this is going to be, because we've already had the Arbok level. No, barrier was- what? Who? How? What disabled- Why would Arbok or Ekans know disable? And now- oh, I got poison effects now too. This is not good. Leggy Tongue is the boss? Oh, this was a quick one. 
Alright, barrier. Go ahead, auto. We should be fine. I just wanted to make sure barrier was uh, universally applied. It helps so much. If I can get two of those stones, oof. Increase. Alright, so 2v1? Yeah, Flareon's already done. 2v1. Wow. That's some nasty damage, but okay. I see how it is, Lucky Tongue. I still think my team's good enough. They don't... Sh they, the PC does not strategize, though. Yeah, you did not bury it, bro. However, close quarter fire blast. You were smart to think there. You also got the burn off. Oh my gosh, we're doing some damage. Oh, it's hurting. It's even eating the flamethrower right now. This Lucky Tongue's not having a good day. Cloyster took zero damage this whole time. Zero damage. Look at this. Look at this beast. I can't lose right now. Alright, so Cloyster level up, Flareon level up, Alakazam will level up. Good. Alright, Expedition 8, level 5. We now are here with a higher difficulty than my current team. I'm at 93.25. Requirements for this, or recommendations for this level, is 10,500. Let's go ahead and see what we can do. Again, I'm kind of struggling with... Uh, Move learning on Cloyster. It's still knows barrier. So bear with me. But, well, I'm keeping barrier. Um, I need to get rid of withdraw. That's what it is. One. Two. Three. Oh, that, that, that's just so good. The, the gem set that I have on Alakazam's Dazzling Gleam is so good. This is working good now. I'm liking this. Liking this game. Push him back into the burn, baby. Oh, not all of them took it, though. Why are you confused? Why are you confused? How'd you miss? You, you missed again, Alakazam. Here we go. Uh-oh, I didn't bury her. Actually, that's weird. Nothing went out. Gotta get these knockbacks off. I don't know how I accomplished this before, because my team's already dead. Oh, and he's confused. I oh, no wonder why he can't do anything. Oh, you attacked yourself. Really, bro? Alright, there we go. That's what I wanted to see. Still got another wave to clear, though. Close quarter combat, please. Nope, this is going into the open territory of the map. We got some AoE abilities going on, though. You, you're just missing around all day. You're just missing, bro. Wow. A little punch from the Jigglypuff. Well, at least we tag team in on this one. So we got the boss now. I'm actually going to keep having him run away. I don't know, Florian. You're the worst. You're, you're not what I want. You're not what I want to go into this combat right now. Go away. Someone else get in front of... Damn it. Alright. Get, get some knockbacks, bro. Just get some knockbacks for me. 
One more. The knockbacks are real. They're, they're what you need. Without the knockbacks from Alakazam, this is not good. <laughs> Having one move though with cloisters actually, you can get the burn off for once in your life. Alright, we need more knockbacks because Flareon's not having a good day. I can't attack. Yeah, you're dead. <laughs> um, this is good because uh, I can use Psycho Cut now. Because cloisters. Nope, never mind. <laughs> Cloister decided not to tank. Let's run away. It also gives my other team a, an opportunity to actually uh, resurrect and come back. I think we got this, though. Oh, why are we in a corner? Ooh, the fire blast of dreams. That's what you wanted to see. No, oh, it's over. We got the burn off too. Wow, that wasn't bad. Wasn't bad at all. We were able to accomplish that. Look at, look at, look at. Oh, we got so many items from this. 33 again. 30 plus food regions is definitely what we need. 52 Alakazam. This is going great now. 339. But back to Hush Islands we go. Alright, so start off with a barrier, and let's do what we can do. Start off with the Daz, and the Ice, and there we go. So that's the first wave, well not the first wave, but the first set of Pokemon completed. That didn't really work out, that didn't really work out either. We're going to have to go in with something hammery, and that is a Dazzling Gleam. Alright, so uh, Alakazam's actually taking a bit too much damage here. Way too much damage, actually. Um, let's go ahead and Dazzle and Gleam this. It's too close of a range for a Psycho Cut. There we go. Alright, so that's the first wave of Pokemon completed. We're at full health except for Alakazam. Let's go ahead and run away for a bit here. Not a great one, though, because sadly... Got an issue with Flareon being in the front. I just want to make sure we get some easy kills off here. There we go. Kinda don't feel the need to use Fire Blaster Flamethrower right here, so let's just go ahead and bury you. So now everybody's back at full health except for Flareon. Let's just keep running away because we got two neat arenas to face off against and they're really not easy to kill. Alright, not what we need. Because we got a barrier here. I need to dazzle and gleam in order to get these. Damn it, are you serious? You're already defeated, man. <sighs> Icicle Crash is just so useless. Dazzle and gleam is just so needed, though, right now. Flareon coming in with the Fire Blast. Get these knocks. Protect Flareon, my bro. We need the knocks. Are you serious? Flareon's already done. Didn't get one hit off right away.
The issue is the, the, the debuff on the defense, so Koyster's actually taking some huge owls here and it's not good. There we go. Alright, so there's the kill. <clears throat> Keep running away. Flareon, what, no seriously, what are you doing? What are you doing? Flareon, I'm, I'm not joking. I'm, I'm really... Oh my gosh. Cloyster's my tank. Well, okay, my game's struggling. Cloyster's my tank and it's so freaking far away. Alright, here we go, because we gotta get a barrier off. Start off with the Dazzling Gleam. Why is the one Pokemon I need the one that's running away? If you could freeze, that'd be great. Nope, you're dead. Run away. What's interesting is I can get Cloyster to get Ice Cold Crash off on these two, which is kind of super effective. He just won't because it's not cool. Close combat right now is actually working. This close combat is really working right now. Ah, uh, barrier. I like how you didn't run away, but okay. Why didn't you lead the Nidoqueen Queen into it? Confusing, but okay. You're about to take too, too much damage here. Please run. Interesting, you ran that way. Alright, so Alakazam's coming up. We need the barrier. Go. Give me some knockbacks. Wow. You took a huge L there. You see, you get the cast off, but you don't get the move down. Like, it makes no sense. Oh, I was out of the range on that. That's a little bit dumb to see. Alright, Dazzling Gleam needs to come in clutch here. The freeze would be lit. Yep, we got one. Get a number, double freeze. Okay, because I need to... I need to clutch. I need an, I need another freeze. Nope, this is bad. So we did get a freeze on Nidoqueen, Queen, but didn't last long enough. <sighs> uh, this is bad because I don't have barrier. One more run, yes, and then. Use this. Come in clutch with that, please. Icicle crash isn't gonna work. Now run. Flareon, you're the one Pokemon I need to run away. Can you please get this up? No, run! Dazzling Gleam, bro. That's it. That's all I need you to do. So hard. This is my best attempt I've had, too. You need to stop running through that corridor. It's actually going to kill you. Did Flareon. I, that's what I need to see. Did Flareon get the buff? Nope. You're, ooh, lucky. Run away. Um, I, my Pokemon are dead. Okay. You're almost dead, too. I did. I think I got a froze off on uh, the boy. I think I got a freeze off on Nidoking. 
Why aren't you moving? No, I, I asked you to move. That early bird special right there. <laughs> You're dead, I already know that. Can you get that off? I tried. Oh, we actually got one down. We actually got Nidal Queen down. This is this is crazy. Um, I'm not gonna bury her. I'm gonna run. Cause Nidal King, that's the only move I have to worry, worry about, really. So if uh, Cloyster can stall and survive, this is gonna be interesting. Run. I want. I'm gonna go clutch mode and ice go crash and run. Tried to get an ice go crash off. But nope. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Keep my other Pokemon far away so I can get a barrier off on them. Um, get hit it up with a Fire Blast. Go with a Psycho Cut. We just defeated this. Oh my gosh. We just completed Expedition 8 Boys. Nidoking, King, Nidoking Queen completed. Oh, you don't even know. Look at these three. And I was talking about replacing them. Please level up. Ah, oh, you guys deserved it too. 446 Mighty Stone. Oh, I'm so stoked. You guys don't even know. I knew this was going to be great. Yay! We get a cool... Oh, yes. Get him. Oh, this is so cool. I'm so, so happy. Ah. <sighs>